once upon a time, this old drill press that you're seeing right here, a couple years ago it was given to me and looked like this. I'm going to show you what I used to convert all the rust to get me on the process of getting this thing cleaned up and ready to operate and it's very inexpensive and it's easy to use so if you're wondering what the secret ingredient is to converting terrible rust to something that you can manage this vinegar I'm gonna use this to help me with a little project to get something cleaned up and ready to go I'll show you how all right, here's what we're working with. This is an old cup holder for my Jeep. Uh, it was previously powder coated. Uh, it began to peel and rust and I just neglected it, left it alone. Well, I decided to strip it, got the powder coating off. Well, underneath the powder coating, it's full of rust. Rust and pitting. And I mean, I could put this in my blast cabinet and clean it off. Sure. Uh, right now, I don't have the right media in that, and I don't want to dirty it up, so I'm not going to do that. So the next best thing, and very inexpensive, is to use vinegar. So all we're going to do, I got this, this will fit in this container. Take this, just put it in the container, fill up with vinegar, let it sit, and it will, this acid, um, acetic acid in this vinegar will um, begin to dissolve the rust. So all we're gonna do is put this in there. I just put a little cover on it, not airtight, just a cover to, you know, keep stuff in and out. And, uh, we ought to be able to check back in a day and uh, the rust that's not gone is just easily wiped off with uh, uh, light sanding or a brush. You'll get down and it will be metal. Okay, here it is about, I don't know, about a day later. Honestly, it's about uh, 24 hours. And uh, you can see we've got some sediment that's fallen off in here. Pull this thing out. See what's in there. That just comes off by itself. And here's what we're looking at. You can see areas like this and say, well, man, it's, it's still rusty. Well, kind of, but watch. That's with my finger. Now, now what is it? It's like that right there. You can literally just wipe it off. This bottom is terrible. Look at that. It's pitted. No. All you gotta do is come in here. And this stuff just, it's like dirt. It's just gonna wipe. I mean, you see how much effort I'm putting into it. Give me a little paper towel. There you go. Might have to get a little bit, occasionally you have to get a little bit of fine steel wool and maybe soak it again, but this stuff will come right off. And like I said, all it costs you is some uh, vinegar and it saves you a bunch of time when you're working on things. So, um, for those that you that uh, didn't know, I hope you uh, found this uh, helpful and as usual, Good luck with your projects.